Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. My name is Belinda. Beauties, today I'm going to be transforming these old china cabinet doors into a mirror home decor. So if you want to see this transformation, then please keep watching. But before that we get started, I just want to ask if you can please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and also if you'll click that bell icon you know, right there in the corner so that you can be notified every time that I upload a new video. As always, I'll be starting off by showing you the items that I use for this transformation. Let's go ahead and get started. I'll be using these old cabinet china doors. The doors came from this china cabinet right here. Let me just give you a little history about this china cabinet. This belonged to my mother, so it is over 40 years old. I didn't want to get rid of it, so I brought it into my home. And recently what I did is I removed the doors because I wanted it to be opened like you see it right there. I wanted to use it to display items. And so I didn't want to get rid of the doors because I thought they were absolutely beautiful and that's why I decided just to do something with them and that's where the transformation of turning them into a mirror home decor is where that came into play. So if you have a piece of an old heirloom sitting around your house, maybe this video will inspire you to do something with it. I'll be using some Craylon Looking Glass spray paint, some white vinegar, a spray bottle, one can of Kilt's Complete Coat and Primer in one in the color white, medium size paintbrush, some painter's tape, and several pieces of paper towels. And last but not least, some Windex. Okay, so I started off by turning one door over on the back side. And what I'm gonna do is spray some Windex and clean the glass really well because this is the side that I'll be spraying the spray paint. Okay, so once the mirror was clean, it was time for me to start spraying the glass spray paint. And this is the first time that I used this, so I really wasn't certain what to expect, but I did um, apply one thin layer. I had pre-mixed some water and vinegar, and that's what I'm spraying on there. The reason that I did this was because I initially wanted to get the mercury mirror effect but I didn't quite get that. I think that what I did was I sprayed the solution a little bit too late, so I didn't quite achieve that. Now what I'm doing there is blotting out the water because that's what you're supposed to do as per some instructions. I continued to repeat the first steps. I sprayed on the paint and then I would spray on the water and vinegar and then blot out the solution with a paper towel. This was the end result after repeating those steps five times. Now I didn't get the mercury effect that I wanted but it does look like an aged mirror and that's fine with me. I like how that looks being that the doors are over 40 years old. There is some areas that do have a little bit of speckling and it looks really good, I think, because it gives the mirror character. Next, it was time for me to start painting the front side of the door. I will list down below the solution that I mixed of water and vinegar, just in case you're interested. Okay, this is how both doors look with one coat of paint. I'm gonna let them dry for a few hours and then I'm gonna give them a second coat and let them dry overnight. 
and this is how they turned out. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up and also share. I'd really appreciate it. You have yourself a blessed day and I will see you on my next video. So until then, love, laugh, and create. Bye-bye and God bless.